What's going on everybody, it's Jay Coffee Talk. Thanks for tuning in. If you're new to the channel, take a quick moment, subscribe, hit the bell. This is Jay Coffee Talk where we cover it all, music, sports, news, etc. So I got a story here that caught my eye. Now if you guys stay up on my channel, you know, watch my videos and everything like that, you know that I was covering the ASAP Rocky Sweden drama you know the whole court process and everything in full i was bringing a lot of updates and everything so this definitely caught my eye his attorney former attorney in sweden was shot today and you know i'm no expert as what goes on in sweden but when a lawyer gets shot it's definitely newsworthy wherever it happens and to make it even crazier the the main suspect in custody you know as this is being investigated as an attempted murder is another attorney a female attorney and prior to all this there was some kind of order of protection barring the female from contacting him you know um like details on that are, are not a lot out there very scarce but there was some kind of order of protection so that they had some kind of thing going on between them now as i just said that was a female attorney the actual shooter from witness accounts is a man a male they said there was some kind of tussle like they were wrestling over the gun before the shots are fired now he was shot in the head and chest but but was able to call 911 on his own this was outside of an apartment complex in stockholm sweden's capital as we all know same place asap rocky got into you know the whole mess that he was in but um like i said that was a a male shooter from what witnesses are saying now when the police the authorities rounded up suspects to investigate all this they rounded up you know a whole bunch of suspects so we know the female you know has been charged and is the main suspect in this investigation but it's unknown if the if this male shooter is also in custody as well so got to keep an eye out on that as i said subscribe to the channel hit the bell i'll definitely bring in updates on this story as i always do on topics and stories that i cover but um i want to just say real quick this attorney who was shot was not the attorney that represented asap rocky in the trial part of the court process you know he was his attorney early on in the early proceedings and then he was replaced by another legal team so i don't know you know if asap rocky was unhappy with his defense or you know there was just word was that there wasn't a better attorney out there as we all know this whole stuff with asap rocky was crazy he was trying to get up out of there so i'm sure he wanted the best you know the best lawyer he could get in the end he was convicted but you know that doesn't even seem to really matter anymore asap rocky's home I doubt he wants to go back to you know sweden anytime soon or anything like that but this is just pretty wild a lawyer shot by another lawyer and there was an order of protection between the two prior to the shooting it's pretty wild stuff um i gotta say this too i mean i don't feel like i really sh should but uh, like it's needed but i'm just saying a asap rocky's whole situation is not connected to this in any way not that i think that anyone out there would like think that but you know how it goes uh headlines can be deceiving sometimes so this isn't doesn't seem to be connected in any way like i said there was a history between these two with the with the restraining order order protection whatever you want to call it so i don't know guys pretty pretty crazy stuff a lawyer arrested for shooting another lawyer so stay tuned subscribe to the channel j coffee talk we cover it all music sports news current events and much more and a big part of my channel for those of you guys who are new out there is hearing from you guys, the people in the comment section. So make sure to let me know your take and opinion on all this. Catch you guys on the next video. It's Jay Coffee Talk. I'm out of here. Peace.